We are going to go live. There we go. Five, four, three, two, one. Boom. I think we are live. Can you hear me now, Maurice? Don't hear me. What is going on here? Hold on. We are going to figure this out. Hold on. I cannot. That's why we. Speaker mic. Yeah, that works. Test. This works. Okay. Uh, internal speakers built in. Test. Let me see. I'm going to try. I can hear you. Can you hear Maurice? Can you guys hear Maurice? Say something, Maurice. Okay, they're saying hello. I'm going to call you back, buddy, so we can talk. I'm not sure what's going on here. Oh, they cannot hear Maurice. Okay, hold on. All right, Maurice, so I guess we're going to use the phone because they're not able to hear you through the audio. But now, um, let me see. Oh, we lost Maurice. He's coming back. So you can't, you cannot hear Maurice. You can hear me. Okay. We're going to figure this out. Are you there, buddy? Can you hear me? I can hear you on yeah, the phone. Yeah. Okay. So what we're going to do, we'll just, I'm not sure why you're not coming through on that, but uh, you got to come back on the, click on that link. Maybe you got to go to the computer, Maurice, and uh, do the link on your computer. Maybe. Uh, with the internet. Are they in it? Okay, so just try click try clicking on that link again, Maurice, because at least they can. Uh, it says his mic. Try again clicking on that link. We'll figure it out. Oh, device not connected. Can you now? Hold on, your guests will need to connect their mic cam. It says you need to connect your. Okay, hold on. Can you hear me now? Yes, we hear you now. Yay! Okay, oh, we can hear you now. We don't see you, but we can hear you. You can hang up your phone, right? Yeah, I heard my phone because you are now in the computer. All right, but we can't see your beautiful face, Maurice. I know. Why? Because you got to turn. You turned your mic on, but you turned your camera off. All right. <laughs> oh my gosh! Technology. This is awesome. There he is. There Yay. Is. <laughs> All right. Thank so, you, baby. Hey, listen, uh, hey, guys. Thank you. Yeah, we always need our wife. So, champ, you see Diamond want to be on the thing as well. So, uh, guys, we, we're excited to spend a, a, a little bit of time with you. I'm just going to tell you on the front end, I'm really grateful for uh, Maurice showing up today. He's, you know, we all know Maurice and and the challenges we have and and these uh coronaviruses aren't treating him well right now and he's dealing with some anxiety so it took a lot for him to get here and i'm just going to keep it real so um you know i want to take advantage of having here so you guys can post some comments over there we're going to draw we're going to do some drawings um i'll do that at the end i'll just take advantage of uh, having maurice here as long as we can uh, let me see some questions here so go ahead and fire some questions over there in the comments for us guys and uh, so, Maurice, while we're waiting for some comments, tell me what 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 does it mean to you to be getting this your life history out there in this book? Uh, it's uh, it's a big it's a big deal for me to to, to have that happen because uh, but I didn't I didn't really understand how big of a deal it was until I did the audio, and when I did the audio. Then I was like, wow, I was just talking about my whole life in like five days in a row. And I, it, it really made me go, this is something. This is something. You know, you know. and wait till you hear the audio. It's great. I, I heard pieces. I got a, a question or a comment from Ann Suswell said, just wanted to tell Maurice, I love the storyline with Sonny and Mike. My grandfather passed away from Alzheimer's. Uh, disease, uh, and both of you give a lot of respect and dignity to the people who are suffering. Oh, that's awesome, dude. So uh, thank you for that. Uh, let's see what else we got here. We've got, um, I saw another question in here. Where did it go? Where did it go? Where did it go? 
Uh, oh, oh, there it is. I just had it right here. How hard, <laughs> how hard was it to write this book and star on GH? Uh, that wasn't the, you know, I had uh, uh, someone who, Sue Black, who wrote with me. So she was my partner. So she would come down to General Hospital and we would bang it out. Boom, boom, for hours. Bam, bam, bam. And then I'd go upstairs and do a scene come back down, bang it. <laughs> and uh, that wasn't the hard part. Um, I think the hard part was the uh, the audio, doing the audio. Yeah, I know you were kind of freaked out by that. And, and it kind of like, oh, hold on. Somebody wants to say something. Hold on. Where the hell are you back? Oh, my gosh. Who is that? <laughs> <laughs> You're crazy. Oh, oh my god! I'm too much fun with it. Oh, uh, is Taggart dead? I don't know. Everybody thinks I'm. You got me hidden somewhere. I don't know. We'll have to find out. Maybe the coronavirus killed him. We don't know. Um, we're not sure about. You that. never know. Yeah. Let me see what else is here. But you, uh, you should come back then. Thank you for that. Lori Alner says, uh, "Working in the medical field, I've seen a lot with this disease." The acting you are doing is so real. It is amazing. And you and Max are amazing. That's from Lori Eleanor. Yeah, you know, the storyline, the Alzheimer's storyline is, uh, it's always been really good. But what I did before I left GH, before this virus, um, probably the best work I've ever done. Yeah. It was almost, uh, it was almost spiritual. It was very, uh, just, there was something about it, man. It was like magic. And when you hit that magic, there's nothing like it. And mm -hmm. it, it, it was amazing. What, and uh, Max is amazing. Even though Max is on a bed, just he's kind of just laying there, but, but he... <laughs> but he hey, does, that's some, but that's he some does. of the hardest acting to do, lying on a bed, dude. <laughs> yeah, oh man. God. But he does, he's incredible in some stuff that he did, man. It was just amazing. Hey, um, Michelle Leibowitz said, uh, what inspired you to write the book? Have you always wanted to do the book? No, the book, it was just one of those things that for a long time, people said I should write a book because of the my life and mental health and everything. And I never did it. And then... I just a couple years ago decided to, uh, I'm, I'm going to meet some writers and, and that's how it started. And, uh, thank God that, uh, that I, cause I, I, I didn't think I could get a deal. I didn't think I could get a deal. And sure enough, man, I, I, a lot of people passed me up, but Harper Collins came and gave me the deal and it worked out. Yeah. And uh, I think they were the lucky ones, if you ask me. Um, <laughs> what does it say here? Leanne. Oh, Leanne. Champion Leanne says, I love your honesty about your mental health journey. Um, let me see. Dan. Let me see. I'm just trying to look at some of these different comments in here. There, uh, hi from Chicago, Jody. Diamond. Yeah, Diamond. Diamond. Diamonds. Listen. Diamond wants to talk to Paula after this, Maurice, because uh, Michelle took a picture without getting Paula's permission today from Diamond. <laughs> All right. And Diamond, I'll say, oh, wait, here we go. Uh, let me see. Um, I'm, 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 you both have great chemistry. Paula should write a book from her point of view for all the partners of wow. bipolar out there. Wow. That's a, you know, if I were to do a second book, that's where I think the perspective would come from as my wife from her side of it. And I think he, she just kind of doesn't want to do it, but I think uh, it would be incredible. It would be incredible. Uh, gen nothing general about it. Part two. Yeah. And you know, Maurice, that came from Heidi Rose, a champion out there. Uh, she's a champion on my team actually. And she's in out there in Washington, but you know, I couldn't agree with Heidi and I couldn't agree with you because you did a post the other day on uh, bipolar day where you interviewed Paula uh, for a split second. And uh, 
it really inspired me to think that, you know, for all of us that are challenged, you know, I, I well, I can speak for me and, and you're speaking for yourself as well. Um, you know, wow, it's challenging for us, but man, the, the women behind us, what, what a challenge for them, right? You have to have, in order to live with somebody that has mental illness, you have to be as strong, calm, assertive, and be able to just have the, like Paula has a very calming voice. So if I'm going through something, all she has to say to me is, you're fine, honey. You're fine. Mm. And it's boom. Mm. It's amazing. Yeah, and I know can, uh, I mean, obviously, you know, that's for you, but I know how important when I, I haven't had one for a while, but you and me both talked about this, you know, panic attacks. And man, when I would go through them, I remember many times it would be, I remember a couple of times I'd have, I used to get panic attacks in hotels because I, 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 man, how do I get out? And I remember a couple of times when I was there by myself, I literally had to call my wife and just get her on the phone. Just talk to me, talk to me, talk to me. You know, and there were a couple of times with my son, Marcus, I do the same thing. And there's specific voices and people in our life that can help to, to bring you out of that, you know. Um, who, who did I said here? Oh, uh, Diane, your Bansky, enjoy your state of mind talks. They put me at ease. Well, there you go. Those talks. I saw another one about your state of mind um, was right here. Maurice has been so helpful so, to so many of us. Uh, Alabama is in the house. Well, I saw another state of the mind comment in here. Uh, why did it go right here? What a treat to tune in and see both of y'all tonight. Tell me, Taggart is not really. I don't know, dude. Taggart's MIA, dude. I think he's got. Have your. Oh, <laughs> this is a great question, Maurice, for you. Have your children had an impact on you with your struggle? You know, I've kept, you know, the thing with my kids, I've kept them kind of hidden from it. Um, uh, so, the, the, you know, I never really wanted them to see that side of me. Mm. So that's that's kind of the way that works. Mm. Well, I ask you a question, Maurice. You know, when you say that, it makes me think about, you know, and, and I get that, that you didn't want to them to see that side of you. But do you really think that they didn't see that side of you? Do you? Well, I think now they now they they do, but for a long time they didn't, man. When they were mm. little, little, I remember going through a panic attack, and I I woke you know I woke up and I was going through a panic attack and I was like what, the? and then I went out to the hall, and the kids were in the room and I heard them in there, and I I just went right back into the room. I didn't want them to. To see me in that state. Mm. I see, uh, and I'm not, and, and I'm not saying that's the right way to do it. I, I'm not, because maybe, maybe if you if if you show them, they can help you, and they can have some compassion. Um, I guess I was too weak to have my kids see that. Hmm. Yeah, and uh, I, I get. I'm looking. I'm just trying. I'm multitasking here. Next time, so Aaron Conroy Waring uh, says that she is so upset. We won't see you at the bookshop in Bay Ridge. And uh, <laughs> I know you're. I know you're upset. That's why you know. That's why we're doing these things, guys. And you know, obviously, you know, I'll, I'll put it up there, guys. You know, you can go to get uh, get get no. Get nothing www.getnothinggeneralaboutit.com. It'll take you right to the link. You can get, you know, the physical book. You can get the audio book. You know, we can get out there and some more support Maurice. Uh, we're going to do some drawings. Maurice, if I can, I'm going to try this quick drawing. We'll come back do a few question, more questions. And then I'll get you out and, and I'll do another drawing. So, guys, get get ready. Put some good questions in there. We're going to draw, draw right now with this new tool I have. Watch this, Maurice. This is pretty cool. And we're going to pick a winner right now. And when the books come out, I'll get it. I'll get it to Maurice. And then I will 
get you an autograph one. Let's see how this works here. Hope, let's see how this works. Hopefully it's going to work for me. Don't give me no, no uh, problems here. Let's see how this works. All right, good. So you guys, do you see the giveaway thing? Do you see the giveaway manager? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. So I'm going to pick a winner. I'm going to pick a winner right now. Here it goes. It's shuffling. It's shuffling. Let's see who the lucky winner of an autographed book is. Here we come. Da -da 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 -da. And the winner is, there's a lot of people. It's going through a, a Facebook Live where there were thousands. <laughs> so it's, it's trying to decide who the winner is, but it will choose a winner. Oh, and the winner is Deanna Herrera. So I'm going to notify uh, you right now. Congratulations. Uh, you are getting that book. You've just been notified, and I'm coming back to the broadcast. And uh, hopefully, where did we go here? I want to go back I'm to here. How cool was that? Was that cool or what? Yeah, I like that. <laughs> All right. So there we have a winner. Okay. Um, what do you and your family do? To pass time right now yeah i'm guessing yeah there's just you know game yeah. they play game you know it's things that i it's out of my comfort zone we're right. playing games and you know I, actually I'm, i play ping pong which i haven't done in a long time really which i yeah i love ping pong man i, I used to, to play like that. oh yeah i, I can play um, you know, and, and just, you know, you try to pass the time any way you can at this point. Do you, um, Maurice, I'm going to do, we're going to do one thing here. We're going to get one lucky person. And then I promised Maurice, I was going to get him out late. So guys, I'm going to post this link in the comments right now. And, uh, the first one to click on it, um, and show up with their camera and stuff on, I'm going to bring it in live with uh, me and Maurice and uh, you guys will get to talk to Maurice real quick. And um, then I'm going to get Maurice back to his family and I'm going to do a couple more drawings. Okay. So I just put it in the, the comment there. There should be, a, did it not go in there? I thought I saw it go in there. Did it not go in there? Did that link not go in there? Let me do it again. I thought it went in there. Hold on. Okay. Shoot. You're like Pat Sajak. Oh, we got Gene. Yeah, Gene is the first one. We're going to bring Gene into the camera here. Hey, Gene, how are you? Hi. Oh, we got Gene. Yeah, Gene is the first one. We're going to bring Gene. All right, Gene. Uh, Say hi to Maureen. There. Hey. Oh, yeah, Gene is the first how are you doing? Right, I, missed, uh, I missed out on the there. book, so I thought, I thought, oh, let me get in there. <laughs> All right, that's cool. We got a dog there. I think I'm not sure what the background's going on. So Gene, go ahead, tell me a question for Maureen. Yeah, it's too much noise. Uh, I think I'm not sure what the background's going on. Okay, I'm gonna try. Hold on one second. I'm gonna try one more guy, Maurice. This is my little Salvador. He he's a chat. Hey, Salvador, how are you? Good. All right. Do you want to say hi to Mr. Maurice? Hi, Maurice. <laughs> hey, how you doing? Wow. Good. I My like your hair, you man. A few months ago. Years ago. Years oh, ago. really? Yeah. How you doing? Wow. Great. How are you? How, Good. Nice to see how you. old are you? Nice to see you. Eight. How old are you? Eight? Eight. You're, you're very mature for eight years old. Yeah. And you got you got amazing hair. Yeah. yeah. It's the Latino hey, in there. I want to just fluff it up. Hey Salvador, why don't you real quick do do your favorite thing that you always do for me? Five, four, three, two, one, boom. Boom. All right, buddy. <laughs> All right. Nice to talk to you. All right. So hey Maurice, listen. Um I'm going to do a couple more drawings for your books. Uh, I appreciate you coming in. And um, I know you're having some stuff right there. And it means a lot that you would even come in here and say hi to your fans. Um, any parting okay. words for you, buddy? Uh, hey, I'm going to be doing uh, Dr. Oz and Dr. Drew 
coming up here. So you guys check that out. You're going to be doing Dr. That's Oz? Gonna... Yeah, dude, with a virtual, a virtual Dr. Oz. <laughs> wow. Oh, yeah, dude. That's what everybody's doing. That's awesome, brother. Well, uh, I yeah. love you. Uh, let me see. How do I make this go? I want to bring me back. Oh, it's okay. I, I don't know how to bring me back. All right, Maurice, I'll let you go. I'm going to draw uh, some more of your uh, copies of your books that I'll get signed for everybody. Uh, make sure you guys can go to, I'll continue, buddy. I love you, man. Um, I appreciate it. I right, love you too, man. Take care. Thank you to all, to everybody. I love you guys. Bye. Bye. All right. So champions. Okay. So let me change some things up here and we'll talk about a couple things. I'm going to draw another book. How many all, let me see. I got, uh, let me see. I'm going to add Cindy to the screen right here real quick. Hey, Cindy, how are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing great. Where are you coming in from, Cindy? Arizona. Oh, you're from Arizona, huh? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. So should I do another drawing for the book, Cindy? What do you think? Oh, I think you should. All right. right, let's Let me uh, share my screen and let's watch it live. Here we go. Watch this. I love this new tool. This is the coolest thing ever. It okay. is pretty cool. Well, what happened is I had to find something because I'm doing Facebook Lives and they're, they've yeah. got, uh, you know, like this one, will, when it's all said and done, we'll have well over 100,000. So, wow. So it was just getting too hard to pick winners from it. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So now I got this tool. So let's just go. Uh, oh, let's pick one from here. Right here, I want to pick one from this this thing right here. Let's go. Let's pick a winner. Here we go. Pick a winner, chicken dinner. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Here we go. And the winner is... Wow, man. There are a lot of people on this Facebook. Mm-hmm. Live. It's taken a moment to get through it. A lot of GH fans, I'm telling you. I know, and I think it's oh, the winner is Kelly Zomponti. All right, so I'm going to notify that winner. How does this work? Um, nothing to reply in this conversation. Okay, well, Kelly. You are the winner. I'm not quite sure how that works right now, but I'm coming back to here. All right. So, all right, Kelly, uh, Cindy, I'm going to bring Helen in because uh, giving everybody a chance to talk. It was great mm -hmm. talking to you, Cindy. Um, I'm great to talk to you, too. All right, champion. Uh, we'll be back next week because what we're going to do, just so you know, um, so – this Facebook, obviously, people will be able to watch it or watch and watch it over. We'll get together again next Sunday, same time. I'm not sure who the special guests will be. Maybe Maurice will be back. Maybe I'll be here with Diamond or whatever. But we will draw. So here's how you guys for next week. Let's just show you right here. This is how you can be part of the drawing next week. All right. Let me show it to you. Is it should come up here. Oh, I just froze. Why did I just froze? Hold on. I was trying to do uh, an overlay, but it didn't work. But let's try it again. There we go. So for next week, just like and share to win. So you just got to like and share, put a comment in there. I am keep freezing for some reason. There I am. Okay. So let me switch. All right, Cindy? All right. I'm going to bring Helen in. Hey, oh, Helen. What's going on? Hi. Hey, how are you guys doing? Good. How are you? How cool is this? Is this cool or what? This is so cool. This is so cool. I know. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just having too much fun here. I see Julie Evans. Well, Julie Evans wants to know what happened to my teeth. Diamond, you want to tell her what happened to my teeth? Daddy was eating a chocolate bar when he wasn't supposed to. And it was frozen, and he bit it, and he wouldn't give me any. And that's what happens, Daddy, when you don't share with Diamond. So, <laughs> Diamond said it was payback. Oh, who's that? This is my great niece. This is my great hey. grandbaby. Can How you are hi? you? Say How are you doing? Say hi. Say hi. Hey, see, see right. this dog back there? Look. 
That's dog dog. Hey, so listen, champions, check this out. I got some good news for you from, from Linda Rowe. Okay, so I want to tell you about this. So August 29th, put this on your calendar, and over Massachusetts, uh, will be August 29th. We rescheduled that event, and we will be in Long Island, New York, August 30th. Okay, we got Mr. Wilder Y, Marcus uh, Coloma, Eden uh, McCoy, Roger Horworth, uh, Caitlin McNullen, William Lipton, and some guy named Rail Andrews. I don't even know who that guy is. So we'll all be coming to see you. And all my Facebook supporters that are in that area, you're going to get to have a private, uh, fun little uh, either bre uh, breakfast, lunch, or dinner with me. So that will be exciting. Debbie, I will definitely see you in Andover. Hey, little guy. Say hi to everybody. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. Say hi. All right. Should, should we do another drawing? We're going to do two more drawings. You guys ready for the drawing? Should we do a drawing, Helen? What do you think? Do another one. You want to do another one? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. I, I think we should. Let's do it. Helen's like, do another one. Pick my name. <laughs> yeah, pick my name. Hey, now. Hey, listen. Listen. There's no, there's no favoritism now with this new tool. I like it. All right. Let's pick a, pick a winner. Chicken dinner. Here we go. Here we go. Come on here. Look at your name. All right. Let's go with. Let's go with this one. We'll do it from this post. You throw it up on this post. Here we go. Here it goes. Drum beat. Okay. Here we go. What was that wheel? Just in the big wheel. Okay, Teresa Howell. Teresa Howell is the winner. Um, oh, look at there she goes. Can I guess I? Oh, this is what I'm talking about. Congratulations, you have won and. Autographed version of nothing general about it. All right, let's send that. Coming back to you. Oh, somebody wants to stop it and say hi. Hold on. Hold on. Somebody wants to stop it and say hi. You ready? Let's see who it is. Hold on. Let's see. Hold on. Huh? Everybody good here? Ooh, anger boy. <laughs> anger boy stopped by. What the heck? Oh, I love him. What, what, where did anger boy come from? <laughs> All right. So listen, guys, a uh, couple other things. Uh, announcements. I'll do one more drawing. My wife's cooking amazing. She's Italian. So Sunday is always a big day for us. So. So we know about the Andover event. We know about Long Island. Maurice is going to be um, uh, Dr. Oz, which is awesome. So look for that. You guys can get his book, pre get his book pre-ordered. Go online. Um, go to www.get. Uh, nothing general about it. Here, you know what? Watch this. Watch this. Here we go. Uh, here we go. Watch this. Here we go. Right there. Ticker. Pre-order your copy of Maurice Bernard's number one seller, Nothing General About It, at www.getnothinggeneralaboutit.com. All right? You can get the hardcover, the audible book, the textbook, all of that. Also, really, really cool, Helen um, and her mom is part of that group. You guys can be part of my Facebook supporter group. It's really, really cool. Uh, we will have special things like this that will only be for my supporters. We'll have special guests. You get a lot of cool stuff, okay? The main thing is we get to make a difference. Last month, we raised money. We're going to give it to a group called Light of Hope. I think we, we raised enough to help seven uh, teenagers that struggle with addiction and suicide. 
things like that that'll get them one month where they'll be able to be in a house. I'm going to bring in Salvador as well as we bring it home. Um, and oh no, that doesn't work because you can't see me. Uh, we lost. Um, and this week or this month, we're raising money for Fur Baby Rescue, an operation of a pilot that takes uh, fur babies that actually live in chill houses and picks them up in his plane and drives them to places that they won't kill them until they find a home for them. It's only $4.99 a month for us Americans. It's, I think, $6.49 um, that Josie will tell me in Canada. Um, and so that's that's something you can be part of, but you also get to be part of a very private Facebook group. We have a weekly Zoom call where we talk. It's private. You get a uh, free autographed picture. Um, and uh, once we're able to get out of this coronavirus, but I actually have some cool stuff coming. When I come to your towns, like I say, when we come to Andover and stuff like that, um, you get to have a private meet and greet with me. Um, birthday calls. We do all kinds of cool stuff. But to me, the most important thing is you get to be part of something where we make a difference in the areas of bullying, uh, fur babies, depression, bipolar, cancer. Those are things that I'm very passionate about. We pick a different charity every month. We have a lot of fun. Do we have a lot of fun, Helen? Is it fun? Oh, yeah. It's so much fun. Yeah? All right. I love it. It's, it's amazing. Right. So here we go. I'm going to do one more drawing. Let's get this. One more drawing. We got, hold on, what do I got here? More draws. Josie says more draws. Okay, hold on. I'm looking at, let me just read some of the comments quick. Hey, Jojo, what's up, buddy? Can't wait to see you. Um, hey, Buffy, great to see you. Sharon, stop, great for stopping by. Um, Jody, Teresa Haas, Deanna, 649 in Canada, it says Deanna. Um, yeah, and guys, if you want to ask anybody, when you see my Facebook, the Facebook supporters, they have a badge by the name. Just reach out to them. Ask them. Say, what's it like? What's it all about? We have a lot of fun. Um, Pam Rogers just became a supporter. Uh, we appreciate you. Lisa, Julius, how do we join to be a supporter? You go to my Facebook page, right? And right under, um, I think it's to the right, right? Helen says, become a supporter. Under a lot of posts, it says, become a supporter. Go to the supporter hub, click the button, and it'll walk you right through there, okay? Um, want to say hi to some more people before we get out of here. Jen, how are you? I miss Anger Boy. Do you miss Anger Boy, Jen? Let's see if we can bring him back. Let's see if he's around. Let's see. Is he out there? Let's see. Everybody good here? Ooh, Anger Boy. <laughs> Wait, how about how about this one? How about oh, ironic. Anger Boy is a rescue. I think that was I think that was the best anger boy ever. <laughs> okay, okay, here we're gonna do one more drawing and we're gonna get out of here. Okay, here we go. Oh, listen, oh wait, I got one special message for you, right? Watch this. I did this today. This is for everybody, right? New times, watch this. This is what it's all about right now when we get the How do you want to be remembered? What do you want on your tombstone? What kind of legacy do you want to leave? Her story is important. Your challenges make you who you are today. Woo! Come on, Helen. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, come on, cheer. Oh, yeah. Helen, do you think I'm having too much fun or what? You can never have too much fun. That's what I say. Okay, here we go. The last drawing for today, and then we'll talk about how you can get some more drawings next week. Okay, so I'm going to go to the giveaways. Uh, hold on. Come on. There you go. Uh oh, I'm not going to the giveaway. Oh no! Uh oh, it looks like we froze. We pushed our luck. Frozen. I think it's frozen. It's um, Real Andrews is an actor. I had this. It's frozen. I think it's frozen. It's frozen. You did it. Done it. 
Can you... No, it's it's frozen. What? Just put it on the main thing. Is what? Keep the cat. And it's a lag. There's a lag. We missed the last one. It was probably our. It was probably our. Is that the? with the lag because I was I was I was I was ahead of you now I can move around behind you he's gone they lost him I'm back. Okay. Perfect. So, all right. So, I'm not going to take a chance to because we're overloaded. It. Um, I'll do another drawing off camera and I'll, I'll announce it. But so next week, all you got to do, guys, is like and share to win on this post. All right. Just like it, comment, share it, post. Next week, I'll come back and we'll we'll press the uh, the thing on this post and we'll pick names from this post. Okay. So I appreciate you guys. Hey, guys, you know what? In this challenging times, look at how the positive that we can find in it, okay? Look at the good things instead of all the bad. Yeah, there's a lot of bad things, and we can focus on that. That is what it is, right? I mean, it is what it is. It, it, it just is what it is. But you can also look at the opportunities to spend more time with your family, do things you've never done before, appreciate the things we don't appreciate all the time. You know, be servant. Do a, do a selfless deed every day. You know, right now you don't got a lot of options. You know, reach out to somebody that you haven't talked to for a long time. Send them a text. Give them a call. Say how you doing. Reach out to the elderly people in your life. Okay? The elderly people, a lot of elderly people are by themselves. You know? Um, and, you know, do stuff. Like the other day, uh, I'm going to go do it a little bit right now, too. I pit, pulled out my fishing rod and I was fishing. You know, just fishing in my driveway, <laughs> practicing fishing. You know, we're cooking together as a family. We're we're binge watching this thing called the Tiger King or something. What the heck was that all about? Um, yeah, dude, that's just weird. I don't know. Have, who, who, have you watched that, Helen, the Tiger King? My sister and her family are watching it. I heard it's crazy. It's hard to hear you right now, champion. I'm going to change the brand here for a second so I can um, bring Salvador back here. I can see you guys better. There we go. All right, that's better. Yeah, Salvador's right. Yeah, um, no, I'm, I'm blocked. Here. That's okay. You can see Diamond. That's all I'm about. <laughs> There we go. Um, yeah, that, that, that lion. Was it Tiger King or something? That was called? You watched it? What is that all about? The husband's missing? I, I don't know, man. Yeah, so I, I see Rosie says the Tiger King. Um, you saw the video of me fishing. The Tiger King is awesome. That, I don't know. It's like I first started watching I'm like, this is stupid. But now I'm hooked. I can't stop watching. It. The Tiger King is the real deal? It, what a lot, right? Yeah. All right, guys. I appreciate you guys. Take care. Um, let's, let's stay safe, guys. Be smart and just uh, make the best of every situation. I'll see you guys during the week on my yeah. lives. You know, make sure that you guys all follow me on my different uh, and subscribe. Oh, you know what? I got to do this one because we're on we're on YouTube as well. I forgot to do this one right there. Hold on. I made this specifically for.
the YouTube champions out there. Where is it? This one. I think it's this one. Is it this one? That, no, that's good. Enough. Oh, this one. This one. There it is. Subscribe, like, comment, and share. So if you're watching it on my YouTube channel, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. It's the first time I've been going on my YouTube live. So this is new for me, so I'm excited. But um, I appreciate you all. Make the rest of the day the best of the day. I'll believe in you too. Believe in yourself. God bless. Boom. Bye. Bye. Bye.